This is one of the most underrated credit unions that you need to hear about. Welcome back to the channel. I'm Mike the Credit Guy, the biggest. If this is your first time to the channel, make sure to hit that subscribe button. That way you find out every time we drop new content, you're gonna hear about it first. We talk about everything credit here. So if you haven't already, hit that like button. That little like button. That way this video goes out to way more people, okay? In case you didn't know, I am the owner and founder of Limitless Culture. We created the most advanced DIY program in the industry. At $55.99 a month, our system will create custom Metro 2 attack letters, attacking any negative items on your credit reports and all your personal information that's not accurate. Imagine that. Our system will create your letters, email them to you, you print them, you mail them out, certify mail, and you're done. It's just that simple. You don't have to join any um, Facebook groups, you know, the, those archaic things. You don't have to read any modules. You don't have to do any master courses. We cut all that nonsense out. Our system will create those custom letters, email them to you, you print them, you mail them out, certified mail, and you're done. Link is always going to be in the description for our DIY program, the most advanced in the industry. On today's episode, we're going to talk about Andrew's Credit Union. It is one of the most underrated credit unions out there. A lot of people don't even know it exists. So today we're gonna to talk about the personal side and of course, the business side. Now, before we get into this, um, always remember, before we get into the business sector of this, you need to establish a personal relationship first for at least 30 to 90 days, okay? Some banks have requirements, other banks don't, but remember, really entry level is 90 days. Establish that relationship with a credit union and then go after their business products after 90 days. All right, so I'm down here, ladies and gentlemen, okay? So, uh, listen, we're gonna do this real raw and this is up to date, this is very recent. So, um, apparently they're having some digital banking um, issue uh, it's not uncommon. Sometimes they go down. Sometimes they got to redo something. Um, but this is in the middle of the day. So um, no bueno. But if you have any data points and you're banking with Andrews Credit Union, let us know in the comments if you've had any issues with their digital banking. Let's get into it about membership. Anybody can join. Okay. Um, if you're old military or, you know, um, a veteran in military active, that automatically gets you in. But if you are not, scroll down. You can see right here. Right here, it says, if you are a member of the American Consumer Council. Now, a lot of these credit unions are gonna require for you to be a part of the American Consumer Council. So you join that, it's very, very low cost, and it's gonna get you into a lot of credit unions. So that is one of the quickest and easiest ways that you can get into Andrew's Credit Union. And I can't remember the other ones. Um, I should make a list of, of all the credit unions it covers. Um, but that's exactly how you're going to get into Andrew's Credit Union unless you have a family member also, um, or if you're a specific um, member of some type of um, uh, employer in that local area, I believe. All right, so we got you into Andrew's Credit Union, all right? So now you're gonna do a checking and a savings. Remember, go watch my video. I dropped a video telling you exactly how to establish a banking relationship with these big credit unions. Not the little, not the little baby credit unions, I'm talking about the big ones like Andrews, Langley, Navy Federal, PenFed, all those big ones. Um, I dropped a big video, you know, explaining how from start to finish to establish a relationship. Make sure to go watch that. But here is your personal checking account. Now through May 31st, earn $200 bonus after qualifying transactions with our payback checking offer. Now their checking accounts are gonna offer, you know, standard early direct deposit, lets you get your paycheck one day early. That's pretty, pretty standard. Now let's go see what this payback checking right here is all about. Get you some free money because we all know we like free money, right? So let's see how you do it. How do we get it? All right. So when you open a new payback checking account, you automatically receive $75 credited into your account within one business day. So just for doing this whole payback checking, you're going to get 75 bucks for free. That's pretty crazy. Okay. Now you can also receive $125 Within 60 days of account opening, when you establish and maintain monthly electronic deposits, $500 or more. So what they're telling you is if you set up direct deposit, they're going to give you a bonus $125. I mean, that's a pretty no brainer. Uh, and, and if you watch that video, I tell you how important it is to set up direct deposit. So they want to see that cash flow. That's why, that's why they're going to say that. Now, there is a little caveat down here. Pay attention, ladies and gentlemen. Requirements. $10 monthly fee will be waived if you receive at least $500 in 
in total direct deposits within a calendar month to this account. No minimum balance to worry about. You must be enrolled in digital, digital banking or mobile app. So just remember you want to do your direct deposit so you don't have to pay any fees. As long as you do direct deposit and it's more than $500 a month, you do not pay any fees for this. I mean, I'll take that. You know, that's pretty cool. So that is your regular checking. So I want to cover something that we don't talk about enough in a lot of our videos when we're talking about these credit unions, and that's doing saving certificates, or they'll call them share certificates. It's a saving certificate, okay? So remember, using the more products possible with a new banking relationship with a big credit union like Andrews is going to come a long way. And remember, this is an investment to your future. You're going to get the money back. So instead of putting your money in something else that doesn't matter, put it into a, a saving certificate or a share certificate with a credit union just like Andrews or you know Navy Federal, PenFed. Look at their, their saving certificates that they offer and look at the, the different types that you can get. There's like one, two, three, four, five, six. I mean, there's six different types of share certificates that you can do with Andrews, which is great. Remember, the more products you use, the more you're gonna raise that internal internal credit union credit score. That's what you want to do to get you to that high limit credit cards and high limit lending. If you haven't already, hit that subscribe button. That way you find out every time I go live or I drop new content, you're gonna hear about it first. If there's anything specific you want me to talk about, drop it in the comment section. Drop some emojis in there so we can get this video going. Don't be afraid to ask a question. That's what we're here for, okay? And if you haven't already, hit that bell notification. That way you find out every time I go live, you're gonna hear about it first. You never know when I'm gonna pop up live. If you're looking to work on your credit, we did in fact create the most advanced DIY program in the industry. For $55.99 a month, our system will create custom Metro 2 attack letters, attacking any negative item on your credit report that is hurting you, and attack any personal information that is not accurate, okay? We're gonna create those custom letters, our system is going to email them to you, you print them out, send them out certified mail, and you're done. You don't have to read any modules or do any master classes or join any archaic Facebook groups. We cut all that nonsense out. Our system is just that simple. We simplified the process. Link is in the description for that. And if you need full service, we do offer full service credit management. We have a Metro to Attack program. And we do offer a full service pre-litigation program that is designed to get you a free legal review by some attorneys. Imagine that. And also we do offer a full service identity theft program for people that have real identity theft issues. Links are always going to be in the description for those. Okay. And anyone that joins the DIY program gets exclusive access into my custom app that is available for Android and Apple in those stores. Okay. The custom app is designed to create a custom community. We're not censored. None of that nonsense. We can say and do as we please in there so we can help even more, okay? So it's gonna have some of my biggest videos and we're gonna keep adding more to that library. Link is going to be in the description and always remember, last part's the most important. All right, so a lot of people think that, you know, it's the end of the world if you don't have the best credit. First off, you need to be working on your credit. We have an amazing program. Link is in the description, dispute like a pro, $55.99 a month. You can't beat that. Anyways, sorry for the shameless plug there, okay? <laughs> but uh, rebuilding with a credit union is like the best possible position you can be in. Stop getting all those junk credit cards, Credit Ones, Premier, you know, Open Sky. Stay away from those and go with a secured card with a credit union or the Discover It. But a credit union is a better option because you can rebuild and establish a relationship. So they have the build or rebuild cards, okay? Um, let's see, there's the Platinum Reward Secured Visa. Build credit while earning rewards. There's very few credit cards that actually allow you to earn rewards that are secured. So that's a really big deal that you know they offer that and it gives you those rewards. So let's click on it. Let's see exactly what type of rewards they're going to offer us. So you're gonna earn one point for every dollar spent you, have, you earn unlimited rewards and of course there's no annual fees. How many of those crappy secured credit cards have annual fees for nothing, okay? So it, it's kind of crazy. And then you look you look at the very bottom here, you know, you look at the rewards. Rebuilding with a credit union is massive, okay? There's a balance transfer fee, there's a cash advance fee. Um, the feature is no annual, no annual fee, which it shouldn't be, I think, you know, if you're gonna give them your money, why are you paying an annual fee? Zero liability on, on unauthorized charges, 
auto rental collision damage waiver, travel in accident insurance, and emergency assistance. Assistance, okay, includes ID navigator powered by Norton LifeLock. Um, I don't know how I feel about that Norton LifeLock because they had a recent data breach. So stay away from Norton LifeLock, okay? Just keeping it real with everybody. So that is a secured visa. If you're looking to rebuild, they do have that option. You don't have to have immaculate credit, okay? You can rebuild with a credit union. That's why credit unions are better. All right, so one of the biggest key features that people always fail to realize is personal loans and lines of credit, okay? You know, you want to go with a credit union is gonna have these different options. So you can see, you can do a signature loan up to $50,000, okay? Flexible terms up to 84 months. That's pretty crazy, okay? Cash to go loans, $250 to $500, you're in a pinch, you need something real quick, there it is. There's no credit check for that cash to go loan, okay? Um, then there's a premier line of credit up to $50,000. I don't think Navy Federal even does um, the line of credit all the way up to 50,000 anymore. Um, now there's an overdraft line of credit up to 10,000, okay? There's a share secured loan. So this is exactly what you want to use when you're rebuilding and establishing a relationship to the secured loan, a loan that matches your share savings account balance, okay? So basically, if you put $1,000 in there, it's gonna match that, it's gonna match that. It's just that simple, okay? Um, that is a secured loan that you can do. Watch my other video on how to use that properly. So these are great products, all the way up to $50,000 secured loans. That's pretty crazy. And also a premier line of credit. So this is why, again, you know, credit unions are dope, but Andrews right here has got some pretty good personal loans and lines of credit products. All right, so every one of these credit unions is gonna have the options for vehicle loans. This is on the personal side. We still haven't got to the business side. Stick with me, ladies and gentlemen, we're almost there, okay? So vehicle loans, pretty simple, pretty forward. There's no crazy bells and whistles that I can find here, but you know, they, do, they do new and used auto loans, motorcycles, RVs, and boat loans, refinance an auto loan, okay? Um, you wanna look at the different types of rates and different offers that they offer for new and used auto loans because every single one of them are going to be different with every single credit union, okay? Um, just like I think it was PenFed or was it DCU, I can't remember. Um, if you purchase through them, you know, you're going to go through the True Car Portal, True Car Portal, where you can get all the lending and, and all the financing done directly through them and then it goes through True Car. So they, they try to match you up with whatever, you know, um, cars that you're looking for. So here we go. Oh, the home equity line of credit just popped up on, the, on that feed where I'm, I'm looking to find out about if they have any special sauce about new and used auto loans. Always remember, do not apply for, for an auto loan until you've been at least a minimum of 91 days with a credit union. You wanna establish that relationship and let it age, okay? Um, so what they're saying right here on the very bottom is financing for up to 120% of the cost of new and used cars. Now, a lot of people don't understand that that's a big deal because normally a bank will only go 110% of the value of a new or used car, okay? And what that means is when you're gonna finance a vehicle, um, I made a video about this before, where basically they tack on all the you know dealer fees, um, any warranties, um, uh, paint warranties and stuff like that. They add all that onto it, plus your tax and tags. So you're kind of financing that so it makes, it makes the, the cost of a loan go past the actual value of the car. And sometimes some banks won't go past the value of the car. But right here, this specific bank, Andrews Credit Union, is going to go 120% past the actual value of a new or used vehicle. So that's that gives them a lot of flexibility also. So that's, that's a pretty cool feature. So in case you haven't noticed, there is a button underneath my video that says donate. That is for Nicole's wish. Put it up on the screen right here, okay? So now this is pretty awesome what we've been doing with this. I started a fundraiser to help donate to Nicole's Wish that is granting wishes for children with critical illnesses. Now this is pretty awesome, whether it be a dollar, five dollars, two dollars, or some of you big ballers, bust out your wallets. This is your time to flex your money on Make-A-Wish, okay? This is pretty awesome. So what Nicole's Wish does is they take all that money and they donate it into, into Make-A-Wish and they help grant wishes. Now, I'll put it up right here so you can see it. We have already granted five wishes 
we have seven wishes that are pending and 12 wishes that have been adopted. That's pretty awesome. So anything you can do is gonna be pretty awesome. I mean, what more could we ask for? We're gonna help make some kids' wishes come true. All right, so let's talk about some of their credit cards. They have rewards credit cards, and then they have cashback credit cards. Okay, so let's cover their rewards credit cards. So you're gonna get three X points with the Titanium Rewards Visa, okay, when you use it at gas and groceries, and then 1.5 at all other purchases. There's no annual fee, which is this means it's a forever card. You can have it in your wallet for whatever reason. And you get a 10,000 10, points bonus when you spend $1,500 made in the within 90 days. Okay, so that's not too bad. 10,000 bonus points for spending $1,500 in 90 days. That's going to be a pretty easy feat, okay? Now, um, your points can be redeemed for cash, travel, merchandise, and more. That's the titanium credit card, okay? Um, the features, okay? This is the part right here that gets awesome. Features right here. Okay, five thousand to fifty thousand dollars. Okay, <laughs> that's pretty. That's pretty awesome. Okay, now, now some other credit unions offer the the you know cash advance feature at zero fees, but this one has a cash advance fee of two percent or ten dollars, whichever is greater. Okay, so you can't liquidate this card because I know a lot of my people out there want to know: Can I liquidate this card? No, you can't. That's a dangerous game to play, okay? So I, I suggest against it, but some people are still going to do it. Uh, so that's the Titanium Rewards. Let's go look at the Cash Rewards, okay? Um, the Platinum Reward Visa. Okay, so that one. Uh, earn points for every purchase and redeem for awesome merchandise. So it's just one point for every dollar spent. You get $5,000 5, bonus points for your first purchase, okay? Um, that's very interesting. So there's no cap or no limit. It just tells you... Just buy something and we're gonna give you 5,000 bonus points. That's interesting. Okay, um, let's go compare all these cards real quick um, that they have. So there's the Titanium, there's the Platinum, and the Supreme, and then of course the Secured Visa. Now I'm gonna scroll all the way to right here, so let's check it out. So the Supreme Visa has 0% APR for six months on purchases within 90 days, okay? That's the only credit card that offers that entry level. The Titanium Reward seems like it has the best rewards because you're going to get 3x points on gas and groceries, okay? Um, the Platinum Rewards is only going to get you one point on all purchases. Um, so, uh, I guess you get it right there. The Supreme Visa card gets you nothing. There's no rewards. There's no cash back. It's just a low interest rate card, okay? Now, let's scroll down. If you go after the Supreme Visa or one of these... Look at all the different benefits we got. We got travel, accident insurance, auto rental insurance, emergency assistance. Uh, the titanium gets you the um, concierge service, but the other ones don't. ID theft protection, titanium does, other ones don't. And warranty manager, um, the titanium and the platinum rewards, secured visa gets you that. That's interesting. So here we go with the good stuff where everyone's waiting. Cash advance fee. All of them have a cash advance fee of 2% or $10, except for the Supreme Visa. So if that's something you're trying to go after, you know, you want to go after that card specifically, that's an, another reason, like I said. I don't suggest it, but I'm going to give you the information, so you do with it, with it as you please, okay? So that's their personal credit cards. Let's go over there and jump over to the actual business credit cards now. All right, so I'm going to talk about their business products, but there's something that you need to be aware of. Um, you know, every credit union is different. Um, but Andrews has uh, rules for being um, able to use their business products, okay? Now, anyone can join on the personal side, but as far as business, when you're looking at these credit cards or anything like that, one, this credit card goes all the way up to $50,000, okay? So it has a credit limit of $1,000 or $50,000. Um, listen, I'm going to be honest with you. Th this one has an annual fee. Why? Okay, why? <laughs> Normally, business credit cards don't, um, unless they're like the really, really high-end um, reward credit cards, those are the ones that do have annual fees, like the American Express Business Platinum, the American Express Business Gold, that's kind of normal, but a credit union having a, a an annual fee for a um, business credit card is kind of crazy. Now, they have an introdu introductory rate of 3.25% for the first 12 months, okay? Now, there's another thing you need to be aware of. A lot of these business credit cards are not that great, okay? But 
They're going to give you some flexibility on getting some more um, liquidity if you need it for whatever reason, you know. Um, but here's what's very important to understand. This is the caveat. In order to be eligible to open up a business account, you you are eligible if you if your business address is within 50 mile radius from any Andrews Federal location. So look in your local area, see if there's a, a, a Andrews Federal location. And then that'll let you know if you qualify if it's within 50 mile radius. So that's the caveat to doing the business sector part of this. So it kind of may be unattainable for some people and attainable for others. You know, you just need to be aware of that. Uh, that's a lot of things. I think that's the reason why a lot of people don't cover this um, business part of Andrews because um, you you have that caveat with the 50 mile radius for any kind of business lending and business products and business checking. Now, another caveat about these um, business credit products with any credit union, I don't know if any of them actually report to business credit. Um, if you've seen my video talking about credit cards that report to business credit, there's already caveats and there's not a lot of credit cards that actually do that because um, business credit is built off of uh, trade lines and other products. It's a, it, The rule of thumb is a product or a service in exchange for money is what's considered a trade line. Of something that can report to your business credit so that is another caveat that a lot of people don't get about business credit cards or business lending with these credit unions like is it going to report nowhere on any of these sites have I seen that it says it's going to report and of course you're not obligated to but if you're gonna use any business products like you want to make sure that you're at least building some type of uh, business credit portfolio to get you to that business lending that you need okay so let's bounce on over to the business line of credit okay so business lines of credit. Now, the unsecured lines of credit are up to $75,000, okay? Uh, that's pretty serious, that's pretty awesome, okay? That's the unsecured. Now secured, that's backed by you, okay? This is another way that you can establish a relationship with a banking credit union for your business is to do a secured line of credit, okay? Put up your money, Okay, as you see, scaling your business, borrow as much as 80% of the value of your collateral. So you can do your secured line of credit with some type of collateral. I don't know what the requirements are for that line of collateral, collateral um, but it is that option. But remember, there's a caveat of the 55, 50 mile radius from any location in order for you to qualify for that. Now, let's go over to the business signature loans. All right, borrow up to $75,000 for your business needs with a signature loan, okay? Now, if your business is just newly established, understand that it's highly unlikely you're gonna get this, okay? You have to establish that relationship and have some type of banking history, you know, um, and some type of revenue, because they're definitely gonna check, okay? Um, so you can borrow between 1,000 to 75,000, 1,000 to 75,000, Flexible repayment terms up to 72 months, okay? They also offer a home equity line of credit. So if you're trying to trying to bust down some equity out of your home, it, that's an option also, okay? Now, they also offer commercial mortgages, okay? Um, so that's a big deal for any small business owner with a big idea, as it says right here, okay? So just remember that um, every situation is gonna be different. But what they do is that small businesses benefit from our partnership with the U.S. Small Business Administration. SBA loan pro programs offer flexible options that can help you reach your business goals. So if you're going to approach a, a credit union or any bank, you need to make sure that you have a business plan in at hand and ready so you can have that because <laughs> I'm willing to bet money 75% of the time they're going to ask for a business plan because they're not just gonna give a piece of paper alone, which is basically your business. Uh, you will most likely have to personally guarantee it also, but having a business plan is very, very important when you're trying to get you know, a commercial lending or any type of lending from any type of bank besides a credit union, okay? Also remember, if you do get the opportunity to open up a business checking account with any credit union, the more money you put in it, the higher chance you're gonna qualify for a high limit credit card, as long as you're personal credits in line because they're going to check it and your personal relationship with that bank is in good standing if you put five thousand dollars or more into a credit union you're going to get a higher chance that you're going to get a higher limit credit card offered to you 
it, as opposed to if you put $500, I mean, what do you think they're going to offer you? If you got some liquidity, always remember liquidity is king at these credit unions. Flex your money on the bank. Don't flex it on your homies buying things you don't need. Flex it on the bank where it's going to matter. Put in $5,000 or $10,000 into your checking account, your business checking, and then apply in 90 days for some type of um, uh, credit card or maybe a line of credit. And I'm willing to bet you money that you're going to get a higher limit by doing that and then establishing that relationship. Okay? Some people do it like 30, you know, but I say do 91, man, just to be sure. So it is possible. Andrews is a great credit union. It has some caveats to the business side. So just be aware of that. Anyone can join as long as you join the Consumer um, Credit Foundation or whatever it's called, okay? So this is a pretty solid bank. I'm, I'm not going to say anything bad about it. Uh, credit cards at credit unions aren't that great for me personally. The biggest thing about them is getting those big lines of credit. You know, having massive credit limits and lines of credit with these credit unions is tremendous for a credit file. I tell anybody, if you're going to build credit, build it the right way with a credit union. I'm going to leave you with one last final gem, okay? Anytime you're building a relationship with a credit union, remember, any money that you're putting into that relationship is an investment to your future, okay? Put the most amount of money you can possibly put. People always ask me, well, how much, Mike? How much? Like, the most amount that you can put, okay? Build that nest egg up with your checking and your savings. Keep adding more money. It's about financial stability with these banks. You, you, you have to understand you're reestablishing a relationship. They want to see how responsible you are with your money. So using your money to your advantage, stop spending money on things you don't need and put it towards your relationship because that relationship is going to grow in age. And then when you go apply for credit cards, loans, the sky's the limit. They want to see a good amount of money just sitting in your bank account. Okay. $1,500 in your checking, $1,500 in your savings. That is a good starting point, okay? If you don't have it, build up to it. Eat eat ramen noodles, you know, oodles and noodles until you can get to that point because this is a new step in your financial future when you're establishing a new relationship with a credit union. Always remember, there's nothing bad with having more than one bank account. This is the biggest mistake that people make. They put all of their eggs in one basket and then when they need something, they're tapped out at one bank. Establish relationships at different credit unions. That's going to be a great position for you in your life. So you have those options open. And one credit credit union, you know, you have your credit cards, another one an auto loan, or another one you have your business, your business stuff, and then another one you may have your home mortgage. So give yourself that flexibility. There's nothing wrong with having multiple bank accounts. That's the biggest mistake that consumers make. So I hope that you enjoyed this video. Make sure to watch this next video that uh, YouTube is recommending to you and always remember subscribe to increase your credit score